of Vlogmas by the lakeside. It is December 1st and we woke up this morning to snow and it has been lightly snowing all day long. It is so beautiful and it's totally gotten me into the mood for Christmas. I have been in my sewing room pretty much all day. It's been a little bit frantic because I had a shop update this afternoon and I literally finished pressing all of the bags this morning and then right up to five minutes before the update. So it's been a little bit hectic, but I am so relieved that I got that done and now I can finally enjoy the first Sunday of December. I'm gonna share what advents we are going to be opening this year and just show you the tree and a few things around the house to get started. Here's our Christmas tree. I'm so happy with it. We put it up last night and it looks like there's a few spots that need filling, but I think that happens every single year. I always tend to wanna to pick up a few more. And over here in my little spot, I have my Cozy Knitter 2019 Advent Skein, and it is so beautiful. I cast on for the cuffs late, late last night, so I haven't even started the stripes yet, but um, I had a lot of work to do. So I'm going to finish my cuffs tonight and get moving on this. This is gonna be a really fun project that I'll be keeping in my Christmas bag right there. Over here in the dining room, I have taken out some of my Christmas dishes from Anthropology last year. I love these. And this is where we are keeping our advent calendars, which we are going to start opening today. I feel super lucky that I was given two advent calendars this year from my sweet friends. The first one is from Chelsea and Sue at Legacy Fiber Arts. And I cannot wait to open up their advent calendar. I have actually never had a hand dyed yarn calendar in the past. Um, so I'm really excited about this. Cannot wait to open it. It's all ready to go. And they also gave me the Hanukkah set as well. So I have another little set here, which is super fun. And then on Friday, I got a package in the mail just at the end of the day. And it was this beautiful advent calendar from my friend Christina at Chelsea Yarns. So I have her beautiful yarns to also open every day. I'm really looking forward to this advent. I've got a cute little tree here and these beautiful sparkles that my friend Maria gave me from Woolen Forest. And in addition to the yarn advent calendars, I picked up this one for myself. This is the Kiehl's advent calendar. I think I picked up mine at the Bay. And I really like their products. I have a couple of things and the eye cream that I use all the time right now is by them. And I know that there's a full size of it in this calendar. So I thought this would be a great calendar to get. And it would give me a chance to try some of their other products. And for the boys, James loves his Lego advent calendar. So this year he chose the Harry Potter one, which I'm really happy about. And then he always just wants just an inexpensive chocolate advent calendar to open up with it. And Camden is such a simple guy at heart. He just wanted his Reese chocolates. So that's what he's getting. And if you guys have watched my vlogs in the past, you'll know that we usually put together an advent calendar for Glenn, my husband, because I can never really find one I think that he'll like. And so I just pick up sweets and chocolates and usually from the bulk barn and a few other little bits and pieces that I've found. Some I think are from chapters, some were from well.ca and um, I've got a mug in there for him so I'm excited about his calendar I have a few more to add in there because I literally just had a package delivered I've been waiting for it for about three weeks and it just arrived and it has about six of his items in there so I'm going to package those and pop them in his basket and then our advents are ready to go I've just finished wrapping up some of the stuff that arrived today for Glenn's advent calendar. Um, I've just put numbers on these little bags. I had some paper bags left over from last year. And other than two dates, 
I have everything done. I feel like I can finally put that to rest. I have two dates that James is making something for him, but I've kept them for later in the month so he has time. So I'm going to put these in Glenn's Advent Basket. I'm going to sit down for a few minutes and I think I'm going to work on the cuffs of my Cozy Knitter Advent Socks and maybe do some homework with Camden. It's been so hectic today and I am so tired that we've decided to go out for dinner tonight. So we are going to brave the snowy roads and see how it is. We are back from dinner and it was so nice not to have to cook tonight, especially after such a busy weekend. And now I am ready for my pajamas and a cup of tea. We just opened our advent calendars too and I am so excited about them. It's going to be a really good advent and vlogmas. So I'm going to have that cup of tea. I'm going to knit on my socks a little bit tonight and I've got some laundry to fold and some homework to finish up with Camden. But that's it for my day one of Vlogmas. It's going to be super quiet, so I'm going to say goodnight and I will see you guys tomorrow.